Hello everyone. Uh, so this one's time. I would like to create uh, to show you create an app, you know, a simple app uh, web application to simulate uh sea rice, you know, sea level rise. Uh, based on the rise of uh, millimeter per year and uh, what's your we're gonna predict it. So in here, uh, in my code, as you can see this. Uh, First, I'm gonna create a uh, elevation which is only land area using NASA dam here. NASA dam, and then I will create a um, find the area which is land, you know, elevation that greater than zero. And I'm gonna mask it, mask the, uh, mask the data. Then I combine it with the hill sheet so you can create this visualization of elevation. Uh, it's quite good, right? Then for visualization, not, not for analysis. The important part is that this elevation one, and for the first, uh, like the first variable, I'm gonna use a uh, for base variable for default. I'm gonna use base year than fifty and with base rise of of C rise ten millimeter per year. Then I'm gonna run this function. I'm gonna talk with you the function later. So basically, in the function, uh, it here, you should scroll down in my script. Is that I'm gonna need to input uh, which is millimeter and year, and then I'm gonna calculate. Uh, first, I'm gonna divide the millimeter into a meter. I think it's supposed to be one thousand. Forget sorry. <laughs> and then I'm gonna multiply it. Uh, multiply to year minus twenty twenty, which is you know as the best year. So this is the best year. So let's run again. After that, uh, using the rice data, I'm gonna mask, uh, create a value map to uh, to uh, to uh, as a masking area, you know, so we can find the area that is drowning, you know, drowning. Then I'm gonna add the layer into the image to the maps to the area. I think I'm gonna make default to be. 100 is it okay <laughs> so we can see the simulation more i guess and increase the maximum here we have to be there okay the image function so it's very simple so i'm gonna multiply the year i'm gonna multiply the year uh gonna multiply the year with them um, with the meter rise then i'm gonna add it to the Maps. That's it. We're gonna. Do. That's it. And I think we should back to the UI. I think you should read about the UI first here. And basically, what it does is that I'm gonna add uh, the a panel on the right side here, on which I'm gonna add the label, cell simulation, which is on the color. Then I'm gonna add label, and then and I'm gonna add the uh again the slider, the slider. For each data, so your slider and your slider using UI slider, in which if you change the value, it will recalculate again uh, the rise. So then you're gonna move the legend below here. <laughs> okay, so basically, if you change the value of your year or the anything else, you're gonna make it run again the C rate as well. I think it's very important to you know you know create a new layer, but instead just replace the old one. Mm, when I see rise a year that we gonna create. Let's see. So it's gonna change every time. Uh, the important part is the ADC rise slider, you know, the function for the callback, and also for your slider function for callback. So it's change every time you create. And, and I add legend, you know, legend, using uh function here for the elevation and for the simple one for the drone area you're gonna use simple legend using panel and hate three okay. so I guess that's it uh, to show you the application I think we can push the application here into our uh, create application you know, that we can deploy I call it uh, C level rice C rice and uh, simple name doesn't need to be that <laughs> Rice. Let's see rice simulation.
I need to, I need to read the names. Silver rice, I think, the correct names. No, it's not silver rice, but silver rice. And I got uh, the name list. Silver <laughs> rice. Level rice per year. Yeah, that's better. Gitu. Okay. I think I'll have this done, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna change the name a bit. The, the code. So our app SD is already deployed. Let's see the app. Uh, it's gonna take time, I guess. But uh, the function is that like that. You know. So every time you change the value, then you calculate again. Calculate the C level rise in this function, function C rise. Then multiply by the 1000. Uh, no, uh, divide by 1000 to become meter, then multiply by year minus 22. As, as it is our best year, yeah. assuming it's our best year. I don't know. <laughs> so, yeah, that is how our application works. You know, wait for the ah, it's done. You can use it. So, in my first app. As you know, show you where the location is, you can have to change the area later. Or maybe we should just uh, map the center object to certain area, like for example, I want it to be this area, maybe. Maybe it's okay. So I guess that's it uh, for application. Uh, you can try it, make it your own using my script, you can edit somehow. That's it. Bye.